Hey guys, my name is Melanie Hines and this is your daily summary of the Iraqi dinar. It is Sunday, June 30th. My miracle manifestation Zoom is tomorrow morning at 11. If you want to join us, it's posted in the membership section and you just got to look right beneath the vehicle. The description underneath the video is where the live link is. It's under the fire symbols. If you need to watch the replay, it's always pinned as a comment with seven pink hands. All my Zooms are like that. So if you're Miracle Manifestation members, there's 26 hours now loaded that you can go back and figure it all out. It's all posted out there. What I really think about all the things going on, all the big picture items, that's the mat, that's the big picture. The micro picture is the three steps to a safe exchange the, um, that you can access by emailing me down below and asking for that. I also have debt cancellation strategies and tax strategies. So those are what I, what I do with the community. So listen, my contact, Secret Agent Man, got to me at noon. It, remember, he didn't call this morning, which was interesting, but it was Sunday, so I chalked it up. It is a working day in Iraq because their Sabbath is Friday to Saturday. But so today's a working day. So this is what he said. We have been busy. Good evening to you. Not much in the way of news here, but this is what's available for now. And he gave me a couple articles that I'm going to pull up and give you the summary. Okay. Um, I haven't pulled these up yet, guys. I'm doing this live while I'm here because I just got home from my husband. It's 348 here. Oh, it's not pulling up. It's just not pulling up very fast. I don't know what's going on with the internet. While I'm waiting for that to pull up, let's go to the summary from the other people because I'm recording this. I'm not going to edit it. Um, walking stick today. The ATM machines, they're all poised like centurions that are standing there. These ATMs are guarding the lower notes. It's time for this to come out now. It's just the budget we are waiting for. We're not waiting for any laws. We're not waiting for any new procedures. That's walking stick. What do you think about that? Um, Guru Claire, WTO article, former working party meetings, July 18th. Uh, uh, on the, that's a working party ascension of Iraq to the WTO. Everybody's thinking it's the 18th. Frank talked about that as well. Frank 26, Firefly, we are now hearing from our news on Channel 1 that Iraq has been fully accepted into the World Trade Organization. This is going to be official July the 18th. Frank said, to join the World Trade Organization, Iraq does not need a currency with value. No, that's not the point. Iraq needs a currency that has no restrictions, no handcuffs, no limitations in order for it to float on an international market. Whatever the case is, it's very good news for us. Um, Mark Z. Now, he has something today that says something fun popped into the news yesterday, both from the banks and exchange locations in Iraq. There was a notice that they are expecting distribution of lower denomination bills in July. Both of the confirmations he received that morning were from contacts on the ground inside of Iraq, used the same words that they were told to expect them to distribute slash disperse lower denominations in July. That tells us how stinking close we are. Why would they need these lower denominations unless the currency is worth more? I'm totally agreeing. Now, there is there, there's a guest guru in here titled just Banker. The new budget was included in the latest gazette, but the rate was not given. I now have it from three different sources that Iraq is planning a nationwide celebration for this Sunday today. There are many foreign dignitaries in country for the party and the rate will be announced and the new ATMs with the new currency will be opened. So that is something that they were expecting today, right? I didn't report on this this morning because I was focusing more on what God was having me tell you. Um, so what do you think about that? I got somebody else, JD, remember he had the great bank story that was on my um, video that Mark Z mentioned? That is... Um, probably Friday's uh, Intel summary. It, JD had a great bank story, which means he's working on a loan and his banker who knows he's been in this since 2013 said, I don't think you're gonna need that loan. And the loan is due to close on the 7th. She goes, I think this is gonna go before that. So that was a great bank story that everybody kind of flew. So JD, thank you for that. JD was talking about, um, he sent me an email today, so I'm gonna go get it. Um, JD said, on your live chat this morning, had some good information. I made contact with a buddy downrange who can verify that high profile officials and a celebration are being planned. Wouldn't it be great if, if Secret Agent Man could be the fifth verification source? 
And then at round two, he said, further update on what the big party is. My guy says a bunch of big shots and press were on site at a hotel all day with Sudani present. And rumors in the street was he was going to make an announcement. Now he says the people are being told it was just a press party celebrating the helplessness, the helpfulness of the Iraqi press and keeping the people informed with accurate and reliable news. So he said, I'm not sure. Um, what it was, but apparently nothing major was announced. So that's JD, JT, you're very, you're very pivotal to our tribe. Thank you so much for, for keeping us updated with that. Um, I did pose his question to um, my contact, Secret Agent Man, and he replied with these things. He said, there's not much of news today, but then this is the article. It said, Kurdistan's Deputy Prime Minister says salary delays to end soon. It says the Kurdistan region's Deputy Prime Minister Kubad Talabani on Sunday said delays in the salaries of security forces will end soon, attributing the issue to an ongoing audit by the Iraqi federal government. His comments came during a press conference um, where he was visiting to expect service projects. He said that the Kurdistan regional government is, is working closely with the Iraqi federal government to resolve the issue. We are waiting for the results of the audit by the Iraqi Financial Oversight Commission, and then the salaries for May will be distributed to the security forces and Peshmerga as soon as the audit process is completed. He added that this problem will be over in the coming months and the salaries of the security forces will be distributed on time. Um, Talibani stressed that the KRG is making every effort to end the problem of salary delays for the Kurdistan employees. He said that the region has implemented all the demands of the federal government in this regard and they are trying not to leave any loophole that could affect the sending of salaries. So that was good news. Then also he sent um, the CBI sold $270 million in Forex on Sunday, meaning they're de-dollarizing like usual. They sold $270 million U.S. dollars. I'm not going to go into details because this is a high-level summary. Um, it also said the USD and IQD exchange rate is stable in both Baghdad and Herbal. So, guys, he said to me, um, oh, he's, he's referencing... Oh, no, I was asking him that question about, he said, we have been busy. Good evening to you. Not much in the way of news here, but all they have for now was that article. So, guys, you know, we wait, but look, to manifest this, please, when you go to sleep, envision the end in mind. Just envision the end in mind. If you take a nap today because it's Sunday, envision the end in mind. Just rejoice and be glad that this thing, this ride is finally almost over. So I love you all with the love of Christ. Please comment down below. Please share this with other people so we can grow our community. Again, I love you all with the love of Christ. Please um, comment down below. Hit the like. It, it just helps this channel get noticed, okay? God bless you. Have a great day. Bye. Hey, <coughs> excuse me. And I'll see you tomorrow for coffee and conversation prior to the 11 o'clock Miracle Manifestation Specialized Zoom. Talk to you then. Bye.